Edmonton. Today my mom's in from Florence, Oregon, and we're going to make scotch eggs. Hard boiled eggs wrapped in sausage. We're serving it with a beet salad with red bell peppers and citrus. It's really easy and a lot of fun. Let's get started. These are our ingredients. We pre-boiled these eggs because otherwise uh, peeling them hot would be impossible. So cold, uh, peeled, hot boiled eggs. Sausage, fairly well ground. Uh, you don't want coarse ground because that doesn't uh, clump together properly around the egg. Then when we've got the sausage around it, we're going to roll it in Parmesan cheese, breadcrumbs, and black pepper. And then alongside this, to make it a more healthy meal for today, uh, we're going to make a salad on the side with two-tone beets, the yellow ones, which I'm not used to actually, uh, a nice red pepper for the crunch, served on a bed of butter lettuce, and then we've chosen uh, sourdough bread to do a nice um, uh, crunchy thing on the side. So it should be nice and colorful, and those are the ingredients we need. Okay, so here's the setup. We're going to wrap hard-boiled eggs in sausage. And you don't want to use too much. This is actually the finished product. It comes out sort of round. Let me zoom this in here. So you have there's a hard-boiled egg in here, and we've covered it with a pork sausage. And this is how we do it. Okay, here's the number one tip. See on this egg here where you've got the where the egg is showing? You want to make sure that you completely cover the egg because if you bake this and egg is showing, the egg will crisp and we want the moistness of the egg to combat the crispiness of the sausage on the outside. So just push that in and make sure you completely cover your egg with sausage. The next step is rolling our sausage and eggs in our breading. Now you saw when we mom was showing you the ingredients that we have panko bread comes. Uh, fresh ground pepper and Parmesan. So you're going to want equal amounts of Parmesan and breadcrumbs and then just sprinkle the pepper across the top. A little bit of pepper goes a long way so equal amounts is not going to work here. So pepper to taste and uh, you can always have salt and pepper on the table if you need be. So you're going to take your sausage wrapped around the egg and we're going to gently roll it in the Parmesan. Now Parmesan just because it's a little heavier is going to settle in the bottom of the bowl. So we're going to set our sausage down and then just gently roll it around. Because if you get too aggressive with it, you're going to break seams and show egg. And as we talked about earlier, that's not the goal. So we'll get it generally covered. And then where you see seams or where you're not seeing it cover, we're just going to pat that in. And then we'll put this in the pan, and we're all set. So just before we put our sausage in the oven, we're going to take these beets. Now, we have golden beets and red beets. We've chopped them just into quarters, and we're going to steam them for about 15 minutes. Take them off the heat and leave the cover on until right before serving. Okay, we have these ready to go in the oven. and The oven set already preheated to 400. We're going to cook them for about 20 minutes and I'm going to turn them twice um, so that the uh, breadcrumbs get nice and golden brown. Right, now it's time to check the oven for the first time. I'm going to turn them. Uh, they're inclined to get much browner on the bottom, so I'm going to turn them so they get evenly brown all the way around. Uh, this must be a very good quality sausage because we're not getting too much grease out of this. As you can see, the pan is fairly dry. Also, as you, I turn that one, you see how nice and brown on the bottom. So I've turned each one, and this section of it will get extra brown now. But we're not going to have to mop the grease out of this pan because it's such good sausage. So back in for another eight minutes, and we'll check them again in just a minute. The scotch eggs, the hard boiled eggs wrapped in sausage, nice and moist in the center, are two different kinds of beets, red bell peppers, butter lettuce. We're going to serve this with a plate of mixed citrus. We have pink grapefruit, white grapefruit, and mandarins. Very balanced. You know, for a, a meal of eggs and sausage, this is looking pretty good. So, uh, this has been another edition of Bob's Kitchen along with Chef Mom here. Have a great day.